Hello and welcome to Let's Try, a series where we try new and upcoming indie games. I am your host, Shatter Drift. We are live on Twitch with a studio audience in chat, whatever that's supposed to mean. Tonight, let's try Street Cleaner, the video game, recently released earlier this month in January by Creaky Lantern Games and given to us by the developer themselves. We should, it is a special treat, we should be having the developer or possibly multiple developers here in chat with us tonight, enjoying this alongside us. Now, I can only assume that this is a game about a humble sanitation worker cleaning litter off the streets with his bare hands or hers. I don't know. I I, I, I prefer to go into these games as blind as possible. Creaky Lantern is here in chat. Welcome on in Creaky Lantern. I am excited to get trying this. This game is based uh, kind of it's, it's in a similar vein as Batman the video game on NES or Ninja Gaiden. I also want to give a special thank you to the game enjoyer for not just taking my request to play Batman the video game on his stream but also sticking with it stream after stream and eventually helping us get here to Street Cleaner by being reached out to by Creaky Lantern Games and thus also having me be reached out to as well. I'm going to smoke games time with this, according to game in chat. All right, let's get into it. Let's, let's drive straight into it. I have not done anything yet. Normal, assist, hardcore, and back. We're going to go with normal. We may need to adjust game volume. We'll see. Nope, game volume is actually good. Okay, so we have an X to attack, a jump, and I think Y is our limited use gun. Yeah, hey, it's telling me X to attack. Perfect. Y to shoot. And A to hop up. Oop. And we have a crouch. Good. Okay. No way it takes me as long to beat the final boss as a new game. We will see how far we get tonight. Oh. Okay, first thing, first thing I'm realizing is you want to... Oh, I can jump on enemies. I can jump on enemies. That is very good to know. Jump and then press X while holding down to die. Oh, I can dive kick. Oh, that's fantastic. Oh, oh, he's a flamethrower. We'll get used to this in a second. So, so far... You know, as, as we see, like any good sanitation worker, we are, of course, wearing a motorcycle helmet. We, of course, have uh, our litter stick that we're uh, slashing at enemies. And I'm going to continue this joke for however long I feel like continuing this joke for. I don't know how long it's going to go. And you are a pyro, so I'm just going to shoot you off. That makes more sense. Oh! That was, of course, our normal appearance by Talakahath who always appears as a crow. Ooh, good, we got him. Yeah, I just need to get used to running and jumping up, guys. Oh, we have some we have some interesting momentum going on as we... As we jump. I'm not used to it yet. It's going to take me a hot minute to get used to. Okay, it looks like if we slash and then immediately duck and slash, we can get a double hit in. Or at least the sound effect triggers twice. Checkpoint. Checkpoint. And we're going into the hotel. Like any good sanitation worker, we are on the road. And having to stay at a hotel. That also means cleaning out the local hotel. Hotel. I can't speak tonight. How is everyone doing in chat tonight? Game, you were streaming some Undertale, so how, how was Undertale for you? You definitely played it longer than I did. Sadly, I had a hard time getting into Undertale. I'm gonna have to... Okay, I just have to... Oh, that didn't bounce. There we go. Creaky Lantern Games is doing well. Mika's dying in chat. Oh, I have to learn how to... Hop on, guys. Okay. Oh, we actually go through that one. Oh, no, we don't. We Some interesting physics collision going on here. Game Enjoyer thinks Undertale is different, but enduring in its own way. Okay. And here we are against Wreck-It Ralph. Whoa! It only makes sense that as a sanitation worker, we would have to face a uh, construction worker next. Oh. Oh, oh, oh. Oh, 
Okay, you know what? Just shoot you. No, face the other way. All right. First boss down. Not too bad so far. Overlord Samurai, thank you for the tier one sub and the three months. Welcome on in. How are you doing tonight? We are playing Street Cleaner, the video game given to us by the wonderful Creaky Lantern in chat. Creaky Lantern, thank you for the follow. We're going to hop onto somebody else's motorcycle. Clearly, it is a local bike on one of those uh, bike rentals in town. Wait, can I just chill here in the in-between and enjoy this music? This is one of the most interesting load screens. It's a cooldown transition. I dig that, Greeky Lantern, I dig that. If you just need a moment to gather yourself, if you want to enjoy this music, Overlord Samurai is saying just return this bike with a full tank of gas. No, no, I'm sure it's electric. I'm sure it's electric. We are here in a very green city. That is why we are a street cleaner. We are now on a downtown rooftop. Oh, I like this song. Okay, I can't out-jump them. What is this? I mean, it's gonna hurt me, but... Oh, 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 you're punching me. I don't know what that enemy was. He had a satellite, like, up on his thing. Welcome on in, ZZ boy. Well, when in doubt, shoot. And then do that double tap. Nebby chilling here, vibing to the tunes. I think my joystick's starting to go. It's uh, naturally leaning left, I think. ZZ Boy, you are, in fact, first. The first one here tonight, as per usual. No one else has been in chat tonight. Oop. Oh, that actually restored multiple health. Oh, I can't jump on you. That makes sense. He has spiky satellite thing on his head. We've got some pretty liberal use of checkpoints. So at some point when I die, which will probably be on this guy. Oh, that's going through the... Uh... Oh, I need to hit the... I need to hit the, the thing he's swinging around. Okay, okay. I can't jump up into him quite right. Whoa. This is an interesting pattern. Alright, now can I smack you? Ah! Oh, we took two damage from that. We have suffered our first death. Plenty of checkpoints. You guys wanted to make things tough, but fair, Creaky Lantern. All right. Oop. I like how his crouch is just he goes down on one knee. It's like time to clean the trash out of the gutters. Oop. Yeah, that does two damage to me. Ah. We might be about to take another death. Nope, maybe not. Let him pop his thing off. He'll come back to me. Oh, they're shooting. I mean, really, why else do I have a gun? Oh, okay, I was like, the third phase? Nope, final boss of the stage, hopefully. I'm doing better than you did because you worked 60 hours last week in your retired game. I'm not surprised. 
Oh, oh, fire. Okay, the little fire sparks can't hurt me, but the fires themselves can. Oh. Oh, those fires did hit me. I like glance at chat. That's probably why you struggle so much, especially at the end. Oh, uh, we might, uh, we, we might embarrass ourselves by missing a jump. That's what might happen. Okay, I've just got to watch for where those fires are throwing up. Now this guy, of course, is spraying litter onto the, the street. That's clearly what's going on here. This guy dug through somebody's trash. We're trying to get him to put it back. The, uh, oh, oh, oh. Difficulty is finally ramped up in the second stage. The first stage is like, we're going to make sure that you're able to start well enough. Second stage is going to be like, okay, if, you, if you're trying to rush through this, if you're trying to be cute while you're streaming, you're going to have some problems. Oh, that still hurt me. I had to lie on that platform. Okay. Checkpoint and boss? Question mark? Okay, we got some fires going on. I have to wait for this guy to come down so I can hit him. He's on his way, he's on his way. Oh. Okay, okay. Come on down, friend. Come on down. Oh, I'm not doing things smartly. Oh, let's try that again. The world record in this game is 22 minutes. I do, in fact, have a guns, easy boy. Oh, wait, I don't want to jump too far down. No, Nebby, that's fine. That's fine. We deserve, we deserve that death. I'm already digging the fact that we're, we're fighting this guy again twice. I mean, there's no way I'm... I guess I can do my jump kick, maybe. Drop kick? Drop kick. Okay, I'm out of gun. Like how I said I'm out of gun instead of out of bullets. But he's speeding up, so he's definitely worse off than he was. Oh. Whoa! Do I have to get over to you? I probably have to get over to him. No! Wow. Okay, okay. I'm also going to appreciate the fact that we're wearing all blue. I know that's just kind of matching, like, the era and the NES style of things. But I'm going to dig always being in blue. Okay, buddy. Oh, I got him with the dropkick that time. Perfect. Now we're doing well. Ugh. Okay, my drop kick actually let me, uh... Gave me the iframes, but my attack does not give me iframes. Hmm. 
There we go. Took him down. He's wearing blue because he's lonely that the big end boss kidnapped his girl probably since he's been in an NES game and they're all about girls. That makes sense. That makes sense. Humble sanitation worker's wife was kidnapped. I wonder how this how, how we magically find bikes at the end of each stage though. What's the, what's the deep lore behind that? I went with the idea of the electric bikes just at the different stops. Also, what is that in the background? It almost looks like a weird smiley face, but I'm pretty sure it's supposed to be like the top of a building. All right, we are in stage three, the warehouse district. Okay, let's take a moment to appreciate the three layers going on here. We've got our, our, our or sorry, four layer. We have our character layer, of course, as well as the street underneath us. Uh, sorry, this is the street. Street type layer. I don't know, but we have anyway. We have these lamp posts juxtaposed to the, the purple fence and the purple dumpster behind us, and then the blue buildings behind those. That's beautiful. Turbo Drive. All right, we get to go to a club. Oh. Okay, this is a uh, mildly terrifying. We're, we're gonna... <laughs> you ever go to a nightclub and immediately get wrecked? That's what just happened to us. My gun didn't even kill that guy. Okay, that's, that's one down, but I'm about to die from the others, so it doesn't even matter. Okay! DJ, you next? I feel like I just got lucky through that whole thing. Like, very, very lucky. I almost missed it. There was a rat right there. It would have been a nice, embarrassing death. Jump from here. Bit of backstory for everyone, Street Cleaner is a real synthwave musician who writes his albums as if they were soundtracks to 80s vigilante movies that never existed. And so that's the uh, idea behind this game then? This game is a licensed video game that would have been made based on those movies. Okay. So it's not necessarily accurate- oh, right, that guy's shooting me. Dang it. So we have a music we have we have a synthwave musician who writes his albums as if they were soundtracks to 80s vigilante movies. And this is the video game based on those movies. I mean, I feel like the next the next obvious question I have to ask is how accurate is this game to the movie that doesn't exist? So I don't even have to kill these guys, but I want to. It's gonna get me killed. I can't. I probably can't make that jump up there. Oh, there's a wolf here. Oh, the wolf's blue. Is this pupper on my side? Oh, I can look up. I can look up. To be accurate to licensed movies, you figured the game developers would have taken a lot of liberties. Kneel next to the wolf. The thing is, we're not petting the dog, though. Game, thank you, and thank you, Creaky Lantern. We're not petting the dog, we're scratching the dog's chin. Oh, is it just chill here until I... Oh, it chills there until I move. It's really interesting seeing it scratch the dog's chin instead of pet the dog, but I am, I am glad we have a game here where we're petting the dog. jumps. It's also neat having the dog restore our health like that. Just like a real dog. Pro tip for real life, if you scratch under a dog's chin and the dog goes, <laughs> you restore health. 
It may only be on the inside. But you'll feel satisfied for doing it. I can't get down there, can I? No, I can't. Oh, I have to actually... Oh, I have to actually make that jump across. Okay. Oh, oh. Okay, okay. Wait. Okay, that was that part wasn't there. No. Well, enemies respawn when you go off screen. Fun fact. Very accurate to the NES in that regard. See, that's why we got the health afterwards. We saved the health for when we took that hit. Oh, if I can actually make the jump. Okay. I have a pause menu or something, don't I? Is it just resume options, title screen? Okay. And that's how we get through that section without taking damage. All right, pupper, I don't need your health right now. But I'll make sure to save you by cleaning up criminals in the city. Okay, so we have a guy on a scooter back there. Oh! If this spot gets me just over and over again, we're all just gonna be embarrassed together, guys. I mean, that's really cool. He's actually jumping across the ledges. He's not just running. I can't make this jump. Yeah. Oh, we're going to have to deal with those guys being up there. Okay. Okay, that's fine. Let's just blindly jump into danger every single time. Make sure we get hit. The question I've got to wonder is why... Oh, oh. I didn't realize I could move. Oh, boy. I do have to wonder why this guy is twice our size, though. Is he actually a giant, or is that a liberty taken with the video game? Cast your votes in chat now. Oh. Oh. Don't get me wrong, I admire a guy who takes a swig of his Molotov cocktail before throwing it. But holy crap. The good guy is Cypress and the bad guy is me after 10 years of working out. Oh. Speaking of which, when Cypress shows up tonight, we get to poke fun at her because she said she's going to take a short nap before stream. And I told her I'd be okay with that until she ended up missing stream. Jeez. I'm probably not doing my, my uh, drop kick enough. Yeah, that seems like the strat. It's just, uh, repeatedly jump on him. Oh, hey, one of those crates dropped a heart. Oh, oh. Oh, he got me with that. Oh, he can guard against me! I really, that's, that's something cool. That is something you do not see in a lot of these kind of style games, is an enemy that can actually guard your attacks outright. I dig that. 100% I dig that. Oh. See, 
like right here, he's guarding me. <laughs> we might be here a while. There, there's a good question that Neb Nebros is asking in chat. Is the game music NESified versions of Street Cleaner's real music? Do we need to check out Street Cleaner's actual music? Oh gosh, I'm trying to trying to be cute with my jump. Oh. Oh, I still got caught in that explosion. Oh, oh, oh. Dude, we're getting wrecked. He wrote the soundtrack himself. It's all the music for the game with a few nods to some of his old songs, some of his motifs. Okay. Uh, Creaky Lantern, can you shoot a link to whatever of Street Cleaner's stuff over to Captain Nebro so she can post it in chat? Okay, we're going to use the cheap tactics. I jumped into him. Okay, we have the Spotify link already. Perfect, perfect, perfect. Everyone in chat, feel free to go hit that Spotify. <laughs> Nebro is already on top of his music. Perfect, perfect. I didn't drop kick. We're just gonna take this death really quick. We're just we're just gonna accept the. This guy's doing way too much damage. Right? Really? Now this guy's having trouble hitting me. You wrote it all in Fama tracks with a flashcard. The OST on Bandcamp contains the NSF files. So you can actually play them on an NES with a flashcard. Oh, oh. Now see, this is what, not what I was expecting. I came in tonight thinking, oh cool, retro style game. I'm 100% on board. randomly dropping hearts or is it timed might be timed oh boy oh cool he smacks the wall i was like oh second form i'm dead <laughs> nope maybe not all right that was what stage three stage three I still have no idea what that is in the background. Like, none at all. I think it's a building. It might be a factory. It might be a boat. Oh, well, next stage. The sewers. Because every NES game had to have sewers. Game has an idea, but he's not going to spoil anything. Okay. I'm digging the soundtrack already. Or song, that's what I meant. We're going down, We're going down. Oh, it's a ninja guy, dude. Okay, this is kind of terrifying. Okay, good, we got him. Oh, there's gators in the sewer. 
Guys, I think we might be in Florida. We might be in Florida. There's some gators in the sewer. Yeah, just shoot that guy. We don't want him running around the screen and messing with us. <laughs> That's really the tactic here. Just any enemy whose strat you can't deal with, you just shoot. Shoot first, ask questions later. Like this one, I should have shot through there and just got my bullets refilled. Oh, I missed all of them. Meanwhile, we've got these punks with their mohawks here in the sewer. Oh. Do I have to deal with him again? I probably do. Dang it! Note to self, also catch the jump. We're gonna miss this just over and over again. There we go. Oh, I mean, yeah, this this is good stuff, guys. This is good stuff. Nice, classic, retro style. Good music. Nice and simple. Is that kid there just there to psych me out? Couldn't actually reach me? Game enjoyed it till we just sucked at it. No, this, this was definitely up your Rally 2 game. This nice old school feel. We're fighting a squid in the sewer. are indicating where he's coming up. Then he drops his bubbles. Cool. That was a fun boss. Yes, guy, I pet the dog. Well, I, sc I scratched the dog under the chin. I feel like that's an important distinction to make. Little inside info, the squid is named Archibald. He appeared as a stage one at mid-boss in, in your first game. Now he's kind of cre your lan your uh, Creaky Lantern's mascot. That's cool. But Sky, I also only pet the dog because game and Street Fighter both told me to, or sorry, Creaky Lantern both told me to. Did I really just be that thing my first try? Game is jealous. Oh gosh. Reminds Sky of Octodad. I'm pretty sure it's in the background there, but it looks like I should be able to jump on it. Had to check. Had to find out if we're missing some kind of secret here. Oh gosh. Okay. Let's keep going. Goodbye, rat. Goodbye, Mr. Pyro. I don't actually need the health or bullets right now. I can kill the gators? Oh no, oh no. Okay, I hate the Ninja Gaiden dude. Monster OP, yeah. Nah, any enemy that's based on... on the Castlevania Medusa heads. Granted, at least this doesn't paralyze us, or turn us to stone or something. That would be the worst. Oh gosh, I was busy worrying about the moth more than I was worrying about you. Okay, we've got hearts over there, we've got a way up-ish. Okay, we have to go up. I'm kind of curious why there all, there's all these giant moths in the sewer. Oh, we got some platforming now. Oh. Now things get interesting. I 
and it's taking us back over the level. Ooh, doggo. Okay, we'll take a moment to gather ourselves while scratching our pupper. Whew. Just, I'm not messing with you. Okay, don't want to miscalculate my jumps right now. Alrighty. Do that just fine and on to another boss? Question mark? Yeah, what are we fighting here? Oh no, not Ninja Gaiden, dude. Oh, he can play off the walls too. Oh, oh, not the way to fight him. Not the way to fight him. Oh, he hurt me off that. Dang it. Okay, so I jump over him. And I... You gonna jump across or not, buddy? Yes, you are. Thank you. Oh. Come on. Fine. Vex as if I'm worried. Hey, you throw your stars, that's fine. So you're just gonna keep on throwing more? Jeez! I mean, on the one hand, the ceiling is not safe. Or the, the floor is not safe, the ceiling. Come on, buddy, I need you to go up. Oh, that was bound to get me at some point. Oh, I don't have... Oh, oh no. He dealt three to me. Oh, that was probably it too. That was probably it. I probably just had a couple more hits on him. Just like if he's not coming up, I gotta go down to him. This guy's gotta be fun to optimize for the speed run though. Coming across. Come on, buddy. Come over here. Coming over. Oh, you're still dropping. What the crap? Oh, I have to be underneath one of the things. Okay, okay, okay. I was like, so I would have, I would have died the first time because I would have fallen for that. Okay, cool. All righty. Wait, where's our bike? Oh, okay. There's our bike. Dude, where's my bike? Okay, now it, now it looks like a beach house. Is it like a dream coming together? Is he getting closer to going somewhere? Refinery stage five. He's just trying to go on vacation. He just wants some time off for work from cleaning the streets. Because thank you for the lurk. Game is confirmed as a better person. I mean, of course he is, Sky. I don't. I don't see how that's even a question. Of course the game enjoyer is a better person than me. Ooh, you're you're, you're throwing barrels at me. Oh, this is a security turret. We got some ass to drop from the ceiling. That's fine.
Oh, because of Undertale? I don't even know who Paps is. And I 100% would not have Oh no, I missed the bullets. Oh wait, I wasn't even using bullets. Okay, we're good. Look, Sky, there's two types of people in this world. Those who enjoy Undertale and those like me who are wrong. Is that gonna hit me? Oh, oh, these are, uh, pushing me back pretty good. I have no desire to go back as the problem game. Undertale wasn't my thing. It was just too weird and too obscure. Oh, 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 oh. Well, now I'm seeing the Batman inspiration for this game. There are tense kinds of people in this world, those who can read binary and those who cannot. But Sky, what about the other eight? Oh, I gotta deal with that here too. No, I, game, I understand it's a base two thing. Oh no, ugh. Oh gosh, I still didn't get it. Can I shoot it from here? I don't think I can. My bullet go through? No, it doesn't. There we go. Had to take that thing out. I don't know if I'm gonna make it to another check. Oh, 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 we're gonna die. Okay, I need to have the patience. There we go. There was... Oh, I can go back to the previous screen. We're, uh, we're going those hearts then. I was like, I need the health. Let's get killed on our way to the health, guys. Let's get killed on our way. Okay, this is a weird checkpoint just because it has this facing right. And we came from the right. What are you? Oh, he's able to smack me with his hand. Cool. I dug that. That was like some of those nice Mega Man 2 mini bosses. Oh, oh okay, checkpoint, perfect. Those, it's always those bullets just right from range when I'm not paying attention. Like, here, let me focus on the obstacle right in front of me and not pay attention. And not pay attention to anything else. Okay. That's fun, that's something I gotta get used to doing. It's just running and jumping and dive kicking. Okay. Come on, buddy. I want you to die, please. Thank you. Especially since I jumped on top of you right there. Let's not die in the lava before the checkpoint. And... Oh, not boss time. Yes, boss time. What do we got here? Some sort of machine? Something in a cat. What the? Oh. 
Okay, that's fine. That's fine. Be popping down for me. Oh, oh. He's probably sticking around, aren't they? No! I think the double hit there is really tricky. Oh no, I'm 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 dead. No, just no, stick in between it, stick in between it, stick in between its laser legs. Okay. I actually might want to use my just burn my bullet on that as quickly as I can. Phase two. Phase two. Darn it. Darn it! <laughs> Sitting here doing a good job and have to embarrass myself by taking a hit. Hey, Rue Radley. Hey, Rift. I'm the guy that did Gloom and Doom and Wine. Thank you for the review, and let's try. You thoroughly enjoyed my reading of it. Sorry to start doing an action game, but you tried to wait until I was out of the boss fight. Thank you for dropping by it, D. Rue Radley. Gloom and Doom was, uh, no, I mean, I'll, I'll take a quick moment. We're sitting here enjoying Street Cleaner, the video game, with its developer here in chat, Creaky Lantern. And of course, on Let's Try, we try a lot of games, including recent visual novel, Gloom and Doom, and I'm glad that you enjoyed reviewing the Let's Try episode of it. I revisited it briefly on stream during a, a poor a poor night to actually go back to it on stream, since it's not quite the right fit for when I try to keep it a little more family-friendly, but it was, it was enjoyable stuff, and hopefully somebody in my community decides to pick it up. Decides to give it a proper go and see the end of that plot. Thank you for dropping by. It's appreciated. Oh, we just crashed in on our bike. The stage six, is that what we're on? That boss actually was one of the easier bosses by far. What are you? That's what I thought. I'm like, landmine, landmine. This is stage six. No, that was a stylish entrance. Never, do I need to add crashes in on a motorcycle? To the uh, list of our exclamation mark. Oh, oh. XMR, uh, exclamation mark crash commands, please. Oh, no, wrong, wrong. There we go. Okay, I mean, that's, that's gonna be it officially added to our list of uh, entrance commands. Not just in, but through a window. Yeah. I need to double check how exactly I make those commands work. If it's just, oh well, no, because all, all of it's crash. So it's gonna be crashes in through the window on a motorcycle. We have we have a crashes in through the window, but it's gonna be. Hmm. Oh, I should manage my health. I'll need, to, I'll need to figure out the right way to add that into our our list of things here. Inspired here by Street Cleaner. Gosh darn it. Being down to half our health is fine. Well, we're doing really well right now. We're doing it so well, in fact, that we're not going to get killed by the next thing we find. Okay, 
Okay, well, we got the heart. Sometimes you just gotta not play around and use your gun. Okay, that actually turned out pretty okay. Is Cypress the Witch finally showing up? Who overslept, Cypress? Who overslept? Thank you for dreaming the hydrate. We are still in the Cosmos class of October. Oh, pupper. <laughs> I can get hurt while petting the pupper. Who's a good boy? Who deserves all the chin scratches? That's right, you do. So here's the question, Creaky Lantern. What is the pupper's name? It's the most important unanswered question so far. I could also ask what the what the motorcycle's name is, but but the dog's name is the most important thing. Cypress is saying, but she's here, and that's what matters. Cypress, you missed nearly an hour of this content. Oh, we're adding the we're we're getting the mambo as the recommended dance of the night. Is easy boy using the exclamation mark dance command? The Mambo, of course, is the competitive version of Salsa. Oh, are we fighting a knight? Are we fighting this guy in the background? Oh. Can I just bounce off you repeatedly? Oh, if I'm good, I can, but I'm not good. Oh, oh. This is cool. This is cool. We leave the dog up to everyone to name for themselves. All right, chat, what are we naming the dog? The motorcycle is the murder cycle, so named for a street cleaner song. Okay. Coil, thank you for the follow. Welcome on in to the Sparkle Mansion. Please make yourself comfortable. Take a pull up a chair, take a seat on the couch. And feel free to join in on chat if you would like. I would love to get to know you. slightly concerned right now. Okay, there's just spikes. Probably. Those are spikes, he says, before jumping right into one. Alright, let's try this again. Let's try this again. I'm digging this boss. Strat right now, probably just shoot this guy from far. Yep. Sometimes you just have to remember you have a gun. You know? I'm sitting here like, oh, we've got our, our neat katana or whatever it is. Oh, man. We're going to have to do platforming with these things, aren't we? Yeah, so so Dayru Radley. Uh, this, this is a game based on fictional movies based on Street Cleaner's music. And Neberos will have the link somewhere in chat if you would like to check out. Oh, 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 that was... Okay, I was going to that hard. There, of course, is the link in chat for anyone who would like to check out Street Cleaner's music, which I will need to do after... after this stream, probably. Yeah, I don't want to screw with those guys. Okay, this is an interesting little... <sighs> Still got me. Still got me. Got to the checkpoint, though. Oh, another boss fight. Oh. The jump is a little bit like the jump in Batman, but not quite. 
Like, the, the, the momentum definitely carries. Street Fair's entire catalog is stream safe? Oh. I mean, in that case, we might have to consider adding it to the uh, rotation. We do have a streamer's music that we often play on stream as to support other streamers, but... Oh, oh, that's fire, that's fire. Darn it! We're, we're dead. We're just gonna die. That's just what's going on right now. Okay, we have to use the top area. I'm being stupid. Or I'll actually win the fight! That works too. I'm absolutely wrecking this game. You've been having a really off night we played it. Game, here's the thing that you forget. We make fun of me for being bad at video games. I mean, this would be a cool stop for a boss fight. We make fun of me for being bad at video games, but the truth is I pick up a lot of stuff really quickly. The instinct is very strong on me, especially when I'm paying attention to the game. It's part of the fun of streaming, as chat distracts me and I get killed. So we're in the middle of a boss gauntlet, so this might be the last stage or second to last stage. Oh, she has a gun. That's not a gun. That's on par with the murder cycle. One more level left. Just get a spoiler game, but we're, we're gonna actually probably play this through this whole game in one sitting then. Um, how do I do anything about... Oh, I, it blocks the... We're gonna get wrecked by this boss for a little while, guys. This is gonna take me a minute to figure out. Okay, she eventually comes down. She eventually comes down. You knew there were seven levels going in? Okay. I can't get up to her while she's up there, can I? So I probably just have to chill down here anyway. I mean, yeah, it just seems like the tactic right there. She's still just chilling up there. Chilling around. Oh! She jumped back up pretty quick. Whoa! Uh, that's gonna kill me. Oh, it didn't. It didn't get me. I don't know how we're alive. Oh, right. I mean, this is a really cool fight. Like, can anyone say this isn't a cool fight? Oh, gosh. Book one and Grub Dog, I am in the middle of this fight that terrifies me, so we're gonna we're gonna be a hot second here before I pay attention to chat. Are you jumping back down? Okay, it was just one bullet shot left on you. Good. Perfect. Whoa! Okay! Welcome on in, Grub Dog. Yeah, we are keeping the streets clean. We've been picking up litter one criminal at a time. That was an awesome fight. Uh, this game was recently released on Steam. We have the developer, Creaky Lantern, here in chat with us. Oh, we're just walking to the uh, music right now. Take a moment to catch your breath. This is what, 20 bucks on Steam? Oh, did it pause because I went into that card? Sorry, it's 15. 15. 14.99 USD on Steam. Go back into the window right now. Get back into this. And it has been a fun little playthrough so far. Okay, so this should be final level. Final mission, stage seven. Okay. We got our boss gauntlet. Are we just straight into final boss? This looks like we're straight into final boss. Oh, what is that? It's loud now.
I think we're fighting Barack Obama. I die, put myself at the top for further attempts, please. No, this song, this song is a baller. This is the bad guy's mansion. I, I'm not surprised. Whew. Okay, let's let's dive back to that. We're, we're gonna leave audio at, at the full just intensity of a final boss. Oh, put my face at the top. Sorry, 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 sorry. That's what you meant. That's what you meant. That's what you meant. My brain was uh, not thinking through words at the moment. Oh, we're gonna go ahead and hide my my main panel. <sighs> okay. Oh crap, I got hit already. That's not good. We're we're dead. Let's embarrass ourselves by trying to actually use the proper strat on him. I really like how difficult that dive kick is to chain. It prevents it from being overpowered. Like, guaranteed, once you're at a high enough level of, of skill, it's overpowered. But until then, it doesn't just make the game trivial. Like, it kind of should, almost. I gotta watch for him when he jumps up. Mm. That's fine, that's fine, that's fine. See, it's always a first attempt that goes better because you're not, you're just reacting. Now I'm thinking and that's gonna, it's gonna cost me some lives. Your big pants of DuckTales NES for the Pogo. And you learn pretty quick how powerful it can be, yeah. to the top right so you can see the health bar uh not right now but yes oh dang it, i thought i ducked under that okay we'll move myself to the top right just assume he's always on one health more exciting also true also true no 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 we'll, we'll move me over to the uh the top street cleaner thank you for the tier one subscription it is greatly appreciated I appreciate you giving me a copy of this game to play through. We're having a good time. It's not often I finish a game in a one one episode of Let's Try. Normally Let's Try is just a preview. It's not just a, uh, here, let's play the entire game. But that is what this has turned into. Yeah, I've, I've got him. I just gotta not be bad. I 
love this music though. It's worth dying to a few times just for this song. Oh, I gotta remember he shoots that down first. Nope. Okay, now we're on the chopper. walk along once he starts targeting. Oh, did not mean for that to hit me. Did not mean for that to hit me. Oh, I can still hit him while we're doing this. Okay. Okay. You guys, fun fact, did you know you can still hit this guy while the uh, thing is shooting at you? I got greedy. I got super, super greedy. I was like, I can get a third hit in there. Okay, we got this. We're fine. We're fine. How else? I, I, I was, I thought I was just like an intermission. I was like, okay, I just survived the, the, the attack copter. Alrighty. Oh. Oh, okay, good. That. Oh, no. I'm just going to take this death, probably. Yeah! We're going to take that death. We're taking that death. Okay, so Street Cleaner 82 is the actual man of the hour whose music this is featuring. I, I missed out on that while getting wrecked by this boss. Welcome on in. The man, the myth. Creaky Man made a pretty balanced fight here. Get greedy, get dead. Yeah, that's exactly what happened. That is exactly what happened. Safely get like three hits when I'm jumping on it. Oh no! See, this portion is actually a little bit easier, I think. Okay, so I just get some free shots on him there. Okay, I need to not. Don't get greedy again. Don't get greedy. Don't get greedy. We got this. Don't get greedy. Hope oh, he's coming back. Oh, 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 oh. <laughs> I was like, I, I, I hope that's not the end. You wrecked me. All right. All right. Yeah, the more we die, the more we get to listen to this music, Nebros. Oh. Grub Dog is learning that people with big heads make for good bosses in video games for that hitbox. Okay. I want to save my gut, my gut, my bullets for the last, that third phase. It's got a yacht chilling out there in the background. I'm sorry, that's not a yacht, that's a sailboat. No. Okay, back to the back to the D-pad. The joystick is not the way to play this game, by the way, for anyone who's wondering. Oh, oh, oh. He's gonna, yeah. That's got me. He had me cornered. I got greedy. Yachts don't have sails, I don't think. I don't think yachts have sails. 
After he rips off his suit and he kills me faster, says Easy Boy. Yeah. We've got this. We'll take him down. Don't worry. I just gotta stop being greedy and stupid. It'll happen. Like, the D-pad is making this a lot easier. Oh. Hmm. No! That actually is the most difficult thing to avoid this entire fight. Is that up and down ball. It's, it's such a simple thing. Oh, peace. Oh, it, it went straight after a while. It's just so nice and slow pace compared to everything else. And it comes at the right times. It's so well. So well done. He's gonna move slightly back. No, oh, that's not good. Okay, okay, we got him. Nope, we don't got him. Okay, remember those are big. I jumped into it because it, it sits there for a second afterwards. It sits there for a second afterwards. <sighs> this boss music was the soundtrack to your drive home after picking your kid up. Do you read these kids? Do you read these kids as a kid enjoy the graphics or died like the old Sega games played before? Is, is it Diru or Drew? Here's Sutter Crest I beat the boss. I'm working on it. I'm working on it. We're, we're gonna take him down. We're gonna take him down. It's just taking us a second here. It took it took as long as we do it before Game Enjoyer did it, or in less time, we're fine. Oh no! He jumped on me. Well, I missed that. I thought it was gonna hit me. No! Oh, that didn't get me. That did, though. That did. That got me. Okay, we're at half health. We, we can take one more hit. That's not good. That's... Yep, yeah, that's not good. He jumped on me. I was ready to unload my bullets into him. I was ready to unload my bullets from him. Beat his face. It's pronounced Drew. Okay, my bad. My bad, Drew, Drew Radley. Game put about four hours in it, half, and a half of it on this level. Do you think you're good for being, I'm good at proving your time? I'll get him. That's gotta be the last phase. Three phase, no! My gosh, I'm doing. We're not. We're not. It's not gonna be this one. surprised at how many hits he takes for that first form. I don't know why I am, but I am. There's gotta be some- No! I should have thought to myself, hey, he's right next to me. He might attack me before my gun takes him down. Welcome on in, Kirby. This character gives you big Mi Michael Jackson smooth criminal vibes. I'm too busy getting my butt kicked by and be able to recognize that, but yes. Oh, 
Okay, okay, we just gotta not be greedy in the first form. And then not be bad at the second stage. You're just gonna jump over me every time, buddy. I think I've juked his AI. Guys, I think we found the cheap win. Oh, finally. Oh, he's from that from the long way. Need you to come back, friend. Well, I can duck under it when it, uh... As soon as that shot goes off, as soon as that first shot goes off. Boom. Boom. Dang it. I'm out of bullets. Oh good, the, the, the chopper's gone. Okay, we're good then, we're good, there's no chopper. I just gotta do the dive kick on him repeatedly so I can avoid his hits. For those iframes, we're fine, we got this one. Yeah, see, easy peasy. That is it, right? That may not be it. Yep, we just got full health. We're back in this. Oh no. Oh boy. Okay, I'm just gonna have to dive kick through that then to make sure that we, uh... Oh, he went dark. Yeah, see, so you just, you just, you, you do the pogo on him. Can I hit those? Oh, 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 don't smash the ground and hurt me. <laughs> don't smash the ground and hurt me, man. Okay. It's Bongo Bongo. That's right, Kirby. It is Bongo Bongo. It's like, oh, third phase. That's it. We're done. Nope. We have one more banger before it's done. Oh, dang it. Not thinking. Had to time that. Okay, the hands are gonna hit the ground before. Jeez. Oh, okay, okay, okay. I actually say close to him. That's not bad at all. That's not bad at all. Yeah, see, there we go. Now I'm getting it. Instinct is to flee away, but you gotta stay close. Got more hands? Oh, oh no. How was I supposed to avoid that? Yeah, we're... <laughs> How do you dodge that? Well, we'll just damage boost through it then. Worst comes to worse. Oh, 
Okay, so here's my question, Game Enjoyer. Oh, oh, no! Was it that first form that you were stuck on for two hours, or are we counting this as well? So I am not confident right now. Like, I am confident, but... Nope. But I'm trying to figure out what I'm trying to do here. Both, but okay, it was it was both parts that took you that time. That's fine. That's fine. That's fine. Oh, good. That didn't hit me. That didn't hurt me. Thank goodness. Okay, I somehow didn't get hit in that. All right, we got this. Unless there's another, you know, another form, another problem. No. Okay, we're... I got greedy. Ugh. Sky, I don't have the I don't have the mindset for the spontaneous gag advertisement. Does your does your home need home spontaneous gag advertisement for the Stonehead? Does your home need home security? Consider getting Stonehead Security, where a giant stone head will protect your home. Complete with blue fire, guaranteed to scorch any would-be home intruders. Also, if you buy now, it comes with two stone hands, guaranteed to smash anyone who dares enter your home. Warning, Stonehead will not be responsible for any damage it causes to your home. For the low, low price of four payments of $49.99, Stonehead can be yours. Cost does not include shipping and handling. We will not be responsible for any damage incurred by Stonehead or any psychic damage. That's cool. Okay. I have to jump into it, kind of, and hit the angle. We're good, we're good, we're good. Well, we took that hit. Gosh! The greed is so... Okay, okay. Oh! Oh, he's damaged! Uh... What the crap am I fighting? I should have, uh, I should have pogoed, but I was like worried about being greedy about it. I'm still worried about being greedy about the pogo. Okay, cool, 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 cool. Remember guys, the point of redemption is to force me to think it definitely to use them when I should be focusing. Oh, he set me on fire. Warning, we will not, be, we will require you to sign a discl uh, disclaimer saying that Stonehead may explode and cause a fire in your home. We will not be responsible for the liability insurance involved in this. All right. We actually completed an entire game in one Let's Trap, so I was not expecting that tonight. But we made we made the progress, we kicked our butt through it. I don't know if I can call this a Let's Try episode anymore, I'm still going up as a Let's Try episode. If you stuck with me here on our uh, YouTube video, this gets ported over directly from the Twitch. You're missing out on all the fun in Twitch. If you want to support what we do here... Ooh, excuse me. If you want to support, based on the characters by Jesse Bishop, with music by Street Cleaner. Of course, if you want to support what we do here on the Let's Try series, I'm not going to ask for your money. Instead, I'm going to ask for, ask for Jeff Bezos' money. If you have Amazon Prime, or if you know someone with Amazon Prime, please let them know that they have a free Twitch Prime subscription included every month as part of their Twitch Prime benefits. That is money on the table to go to content creators like me or somebody else who you think is more deserving. Doesn't matter. The only way you lose 
is by not giving it to someone. It's by letting Jeff Bezos keep it. Because really, when else are you going to get a chance to dip your hand into Jeff Bezos' pocket and pull some pocket up change from him? Hard hat Rick. Skip Riggins. So here, here's the question. Where are the bosses in the movie? In our fictional movie here? Protector 101, O Ninja John, Kogex. They were actually a really fun fight, just because of how terrifying that fight was with three of them running around. Stockbot. Day one? Day one? Big Jerry. Big Jerry was a pain. Street Cleaner saying that he wants me to have Bezos' dollars. That is right here in chat being said by the one and only Street Cleaner right now. Also check out Street Cleaner's music. I, um... Nebro is Cypress. One of you please remind me Archibald, of course. From the other... Games by Creaky Lantern. Master Fang. Master Fang was, was ter- Oh, right. Master Fang was actually the boss Ninja Gaiden, dude. Thank you for hosting in chat. Also remind me to make sure it ends up in the YouTube video. Forbot and Orb. Forbot was cool. Orb was a surprisingly easy boss. Orb was easier than some of the bosses that came beforehand. Lady Hades and the Hoplite. The Hoplite was really cool. Really dug the Hoplite. I also, I also liked having multiple bosses in a single level. Like, multiple new bosses. Agent Artemis was possibly the best fight in this game. And, and Mr. Boss. Or is it MR Boss? I don't know. And the Great Gadfly. Now, I also want to know... MR? Okay, it's MR. I want to know if the Great Gadfly was in the movie. Or if that's in addition to the video game. It's the important things here. The important things we have to know. Kirby, thank you for lurking. I'm glad you were enjoying the music. I'm glad you were enjoying the boss fight. Please check out Street Cleaner's music. It is also stream safe, Kirby. Um, I know that you are looking for some new songs, some new themes for characters in the CWL. Or that you always are, at least. So definitely... Definitely connect with all that. MR is obsessed with Socrates. Okay. I am being thanked for playing, and I thank you for watching. Saving right now, because stream save tunes, yeah. Oh. Music test unlocked! This is why we don't end Let's Try Episodes prematurely. If you beat the game, you get the music test. The most important part of the game. Stay at the next screen for a minute. Okay, this screen? I assume this screen. Okay, I, I saw that then was his mansion in the background slowly coming into view. That's why the palm trees... Okay, okay, so we, we were getting closer and closer to his place. <gasps> What's our dog doing? Our dog is dragging us out. We survived. Did I pet the dog? Yes, I pet the dog. Wait, so do, do, we have, do we have multiple endings? If we didn't pet the dog, do we not get dragged out? Because here's the thing, I wouldn't have realized that you pressed down to pet the dog originally. Like, I realized the dog was friendly, but I didn't, I wouldn't have picked up to pet the dog. Did I pet the dog enough? Am I waiting for more stuff to happen? The dog always does the right things. Dogs love unconditional. Okay, okay. Is that it? Am I still sitting here watching this? Enjoying watching this match me on fire, that's it? The dog's just chilling there, wagging his tail? See... Eh... I was briefly wondering, like, you know, if you don't pet the dog, the dog just kind of sits... or Hmm. My brain is now theorizing about, like, possible endings you could have on the dog. The problem is that the dog also restores your health. So the hard, the hard ending would be not restoring the health on the dog. I mean, not, not hard by a whole lot, necessarily. Thank you, Street Cleaner. Thank you. Okay, we're continuing. We're continuing on. Is that it? Oh, we have our times. Took us one hour, 16 minutes, 
38.54 seconds. We had 40 deaths. We did not find any of the hidden galleries. What was your time, Game Enjoyer? Four hours? But no, Game Enjoyer, I, in all seriousness, I owe you a huge thank you for streaming Batman as many days as you did so that Creaky Lantern was able to... Or was it Street Cleaner? You were the one who discovered us on, on Discord? Or was Creaky Lantern? I'm realizing now I need, to, I need to make sure I know who is who right now. You didn't know this last portion of the session when you beat me because nobody was there to tell you. Oh, that's unfortunate. That's an unfortunate game. It was Street Cleaner on Discord who, who reached out to Game Enjoyer and also reached out to me. So I'm assuming it's Street Cleaner who was the one who reached out. And Creaky Lantern has been here with us throughout the evening. It was Street Cleaner who reached out. So Street Cleaner, thank you. This has been fantastic to play through. It's not often I finish a game in a Let's Try in one episode. We have our music test unlocked. And for more Let's Try content, feel free to subscribe to uh, here on YouTube since you'll be watching this on YouTube, odds are. Everyone here on Twitch is watching us live. If you want to watch live, every Tuesday night we do indie game coverage. I will see you next time.